Today I'm going to be talking about gain staging your vocal chain in your Apollo and doing that in Pro Tools as well, just making sure that you're not clipping anywhere in your vocal chain. So I have an SM57 set up right now, that's what you're seeing in Pro Tools, and I'm just going to keep it in monitor mode. I don't have a compressor on it right now, and I'm just going to make it clip. I'm going to mute the mic so you guys don't have to listen to that. Here it goes. So I have clipped the microphone in Pro Tools. You can see it right there. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put on an 1176 and I'm going to make it where it's not clipping in the Apollo app here. So let's do that. I'm grabbing the legacy, which comes with every Apollo. And here we go. You can see on my microphone that I'm actually speaking into for the video, it was clipping. And here the 1176 was on, but yet it's still clipping. And that's partly, that's because we're in monitor mode. If I put it into record mode now, the effects that I have on the SM57 are actually going into Pro Tools. It's going to be capturing those effects. Let's see if it clips. It did not clip in Pro Tools. You can see it here. It would have lit up red just like it did before. But it is clipping in the Apollo. So I'm going to do it again with this and watch what happens when I take off the compressor. It's clipping. It's clipping in uh, the Apollo. And so what we want to do is we want to gain stage our microphone better where that when a singer is being dynamic and they're at the top of their lungs, we want to make sure that those peaks aren't actually peaking the preamp because that's what's happening. We're clipping out the preamp, we're clipping the converters, and that's going to get us a type of distortion we don't want. So let's bring it down here, and then I'm going to yell. So you can see in Pro Tools that it is not clipping there. I brought it down. The level is, uh, it's not anywhere near clipping. Now I'm going to turn on the compressor and I'm going to yell and I'm going to set it where it's getting somewhere between 3 to 5 dB of gain reduction. So this input knob dictates when the compressor kicks on, like what level, it's basically the threshold. It's giving me 5 dB of gain reduction. Now I need to kind of match it to make sure that I'm not just making the signal louder. So I'm trying to level match there. Basically, the point of this video is that you need to set your preamp where it's not going to peak for whatever performance is going on. And then you can start adding plugins and gain staging that way. You need to have, if you want to capture your effects in the Apollo app, if you want to capture them in your DAW, it needs to be on UAD record. If you're in monitor mode, you're not going to capture any of the plugins. So either way, you need to make sure you're not clipping out the preamp. Even if you have a compressor that's squashing it down, where if you're in monitor mode and it's squashing it down, it won't clip out Pro Tools, but you're still clipping your converters and you're going to have distortion on your track that isn't saturation that you want. It's actual converters clipping, which is not a pleasant sound. If you guys got any value out of this video, hit the like button. Let me know what you thought down below, and I'll catch you on the next one.